Hey guys, so I'm in Koh Lantern still, my third day I believe, <laughs> the, lost the count, definitely extending for two or three days more, to, so that I'm able to explore all of this beautiful island. It's big enough to explore all of it if you give a few days of time, you know, and have a motorbike. <laughs> motorbike here is perfect, there's no traffic, you know, like, uh, uh, so you can drive uh, pretty safe here and don't worry about uh, Accidents, though of course they can happen, you know, it's not sad. So today's plan is, uh, I don't know, hit uh, different uh, locations in the south part of Ireland. Now I'm on the, one of these beaches. Looks pretty cool. Small beach. And I'm gonna go down, down south, there's a waterfall, a re really great viewpoint. And uh, maybe hit the old town. Old town was created by gypsy pirates. Then we'll see where the tow road takes us, you know. As you know, I don't really plan too much far in advance. There's no point plan. <laughs> Just go with the flow. Just go with the flow. Okay. Going back to motorbike, I think. This we have seen. Time to move on. Time is limited. I like it. Now it's like... Uh, it's like uh, low season, plus it's, uh, you know, still after COVID and so there's not many people here. Uh, bad for the businesses, of course, but uh, for those people who decide to come here in this uh, this time, and now is the end of April of 22, it's definitely worth it because uh, you get this opportunity and chance to have all this for yourself, you know? You can go on a beach, chill there's no one around it will be the best relaxation ever <laughs> you know like like in some places like Fifi there there's plenty of people but here in Colanta none like you literally can count amount of tourists that staying here at this time at least at the beach where I'm staying which is uh, like three kilometer down from the pier right this is my horse Hitting the road. <laughs> I've been told the waterfall is there. <laughs> it's like a 30 minute hike or so. So I have to hike through this forest. So I'm hiking through this forest or jungle, I'm not sure what would be the proper name. I hope this is the right way <laughs> and I hope nothing eats me then but I do want to see that cave and waterfall so I do have to do what I do <laughs> I'm not sure that that made any sense what I just said but it sounded right at the moment okay back to the river It's extremely hot. Well, here in the forest actually it's not that bad. There's a shadow, but humidity, you know. I've done it. <laughs> I've gotten to the waterfall. It's actually very nice. Hidden spot. Oh, I'm tired, a bit tired, I'm thirsty actually. But this is a nice hike through the jungle. To see a waterfall. So it does feel nice, very refreshing. Now, I'm not really sure where I am. <laughs> Fuck. Ding it. Right. Got back to my horse. <laughs> Time to move on, I guess. See a different place. So when you after the waterfall, when you go down the road, you get at this cafe here with amazing view. So ordered passion fruit 
shake. <laughs> Hundred bar. Looks really nice. Mm. Mm. Oh, I love passion fruit shakes. They're so refreshing in this heat. Whew. Gonna finish this and move down. Great. Time to leave. Time to move on. Let's see. I'm gonna go down, try to see this national park thing, and then we'll talk them as it's around 2 o'clock. <laughs> Time's running out. Let's see. I go to the national park. So, for adults, if you're on a motorbike, it will be 220 baht if you're alone. You'll see. There's like this hike you can go around. It's like two kilometer hike. <laughs> so I, I'm not sure that uh, I'm gonna do it. It's, it probably takes like one hour. And if I wanna hit the whole town, you'll see. First I go around there. Let's see what's the story. And then maybe if I still have a chance, time, I'll hit that one there. So that's the map. Did you see? That's around uh, two, two kilometers. Bit of a hike in the sea, no? Okay, let's go, let's see. What's the story? Definitely going to the lighthouse. Just first, see what's around here. It's a really nice place. Like, I don't know if it's uh, 200 baht worth, but uh, it's nice. Small nice beach. I'm hiking that now. Okay. Okay. That does look a bit dodgy there. <laughs> Yeah, we're gonna fall. We don't want to fall there. Then you're fucked. I think I'm leaving this place, skipping the trail. I hope I'm not missing something really stunning and amazing. <laughs> and going to Altam. Hope I have enough time. <laughs> So I finally got to the old town. <laughs> it's, it's a very small place. Uh, and uh, if it's true what the legends say, <laughs> I'm not sure are there legends or that's actual historical fact, but uh, it is said that uh, this place was built by the gypsy pirates who came from China. So there's actually a lot of uh, Chinese influence in the architecture of the houses here like all those small piers there I, I'm sure if all of them but most of them are actually small cafes and uh, restaurants I was there like two days ago it's really nice very very nice scenic uh, <laughs> scenic uh, place to have a small break you know right let's hit the street Great place to come and buy souvenirs if Kolant uh, is your final destination in your Thailand adventure. Then great spot uh, to buy uh, souvenirs. Let's see what's that. So 
so as you can see really nice view <laughs> for a lunch breakfast or dinner or just a smoothie with it's not big it's basically this this is more or less already all the old town it's very tiny and that's it basically <laughs> How are you today? Good! Always good! <laughs> How are you? Hot, hot! Ah, no, nah, come on. Not hot! <laughs> As I said, it's a very small, tiny place, but definitely worth uh, coming and seeing, you know? It's a nice vibe, I must say. Nice vibe. All right. I think that's it. <laughs> Old town is done. So now, Time to head back and have a dinner as I'm fucking starving. Ran will cook something nice today. Some kind of fish, I think. Oh, it'll be good. Okay, one last look. <laughs> Before I go, just couldn't resist. And it's really cool here. I like it. I like it. it's very, it's very nice. The nature is and uh, very peaceful. Right, no for real, <laughs> don't want to go back.